with wifey. We're going to the spot right here. Faux Viet. And where we at? Newington. Let's go. YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, it's your main man, Dame Drops, back in with another Super Official. Four of you can't dig it, baby. I know you can't. Hey, listen, man. All right, you guys said, Dame, stop playing games and get some foe in your life, baby. The only person I know that knows about foe is, of course, Mrs. Drops, a.k.a. Wifey. And being the fact that she had off today, she's joining me in today's food review. So for those that never seen Wifey before, you're seeing it now. If those actually thought that Wifey was actually Caucasian, no, she's not. She's Puerto Rican. <laughs> all right, so I grabbed up the PC4, which is the faux guy. All right, we have uh, rice noodles all up in the building with some of that chicken. Uh, wifey received is the faux tie for $10.50 instead of $10, and she was able to get the beef cuts all up in the building. All right, oh, I got to eat this with chopsticks? No, I'm sure they put spoons in there, too. I hope so, because I can't get down with chopsticks, man. I can't do that. All right, what we got up in here? Probably rice. This is, no, that's beef. I'm about to say, this rice got some stank on it. Don't smell like no rice. You got, got beef. Drop that into. What is not? What beef? Who? What is that? You got to drop that into the soup. Hold on, y'all got to see this. As you can see, everything is raw in here. The beef game down there is raw. Raw onions. Raw. What's that? What's that green stuff? Cilantro. cilantro, raw cilantro. Everybody's raw. Hold up. What's this? That is the stuff that goes inside. These are the noodles. And this is probably. Beautiful. Yo, faux got too much going on. Why must I have to do everything manually? Because this is not a fast food joint. This is a restaurant joint. That looks like your chicken broth. No, this looks like when I go to the doctor and he says pee in the cup. And it feels warm like my pee, too. If your pee is this hot, then we have a personal problem. We need to figure it out. <laughs> yeah. Why are you trying to play me, yo? I'm just saying. All right, good. They gave me a spoon. I, I don't know how to use chopsticks, yo. I ain't going to stunt. Fast food game don't have chopsticks in it, baby. Well, it's not fast food. It's meant to be eaten in the restaurant or at home. I think something attacked me. It's definitely not meant to be eaten in a car. Well, this is what we do. You know what I'm saying? All right, so I just... Yo, your chicken stink. That's your chicken. Yo, that... It's the season. I'll see. Stop. Put it in. Come it stink, on. yo. Put it in. Like a big boy. All right, y'all. So this is the process. You got to actually take everything out and put it into the the broth, correct? Mm-hmm. All right. And to get it all out. Oh. Your word. Don't spill none of that on you. That's going to be hot. All right. That's all my chicken info. Get the little broth down a little bit. Onions and some cilantro in there. You can try and put some of these in there. What is that? No, what, what is it? What's stop? What is that? Just an earthy flavor. I don't want any earth. I want the chicken. I'm trying, babe. I'm trying. And I don't know what this is, but I'm assuming this is to make it spicy. Spicy. Okay. All right. So I'm going for the green onion, the chicken, and the cilantro. I'm not gonna stunt. I didn't know what to expect. That that's good. That tastes good. Mm -hmm. Let me get some of this onion now that the onion been cooked up too. I mean, it looks real basic. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. For I think the one we have is a uh, ten dollars. I'll double check the price in a minute. Yeah, but nice. this is a flavorful bite. It's a hearty bite, and you know it's snowing outside. B. It's cold out. This this works. It's gonna hold you down. Mm-hmm. Again, in, in the back of your mind, if you're just kind of running through chicken broth and you know about the flavor of a chicken broth, it, it, it's light. Sometimes it's a little salty, except my particular foe isn't salty whatsoever. The onions, oh. of course, when the onions are raw, been cooked up, you have that onion breath, it's automatic. 
it's a hint of salt. The chicken isn't necessarily tender, but it's not tough either. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm a, not, not, I'll expect it for it to be mushy all up inside uh, the broth, but that's not necessarily the case. Uh, that's a whole lot going on that you're trying to feed me. It's the beef. Beef. Noodles. All right. Ah. Uh -huh. Yours is more like a chicken noodle soup. Probably because I didn't get my noodles yet. I can't get noodles with a spoon. Oh. I'ma just I'ma figure out. I'ma figure out how to use some chopsticks right on camera, y'all. Word up. I'ma figure out how to use some chopsticks right on camera. But your thing is more flavorful. Alright, but how do I use these chopsticks, man? Not like that. Not like that. Well apparently not. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Keep them like this. Like what? Like this? There you go. And then just grab on to yep. anything. Yep. Whatever you can. Thug status. Ah. Uh-huh. Oh. My phone has a different type of flavor. Not necessarily chicken noodle soup, chicken noodle soup with a soda on the side. However, your broth even looked different off the muscle. Well than beef this one. Bro yeah, beef broth is always darker. Right. So you're gonna expect for it to be darker. Alright. I don't know. Yours has it just has a distinct flavor. I don't know if it has a little bit of ginger in the broth or something, but there's mm. definitely a different. It's not just. A I'm, I'm being educated right now, y'all. Rock with your boy. For those of you, my my faux pros, my faux pros out in the building, in the comment section below, help your boy understand what the difference is with that beef flow. I'm telling you, I'm getting chicken noodle soup for real. Campbell's chicken noodle soup, no doubt. But it could be just because you mix the two. Try and drink this by itself without. After, not don't eat this one after that. Hmm. Let me drink it. Like just taste the broth. Be careful, it's hot. It's like a, it's like a light, exactly. like a light watery gravy. So it doesn't taste like chicken noodle soup anymore. No. Because you weren't eating it right after. I don't know, it's crazy. I like it though. Faux Vietnamese is a five all day from your main man, Dame. Both beef and chicken, straight banging, straight off the chart. I, yo, I'm, I'm amazed. I'm impressed. And I really didn't think I was going to dig it like this, but I'm I'm digging it. I'm digging it 100. I'm, I'm digging surprised it. surprised that you're digging it too because you're not a soup person. Nah, I, I don't get down with soup. You try to make me soup at home, I'm like, nah, mm -hmm. I ain't even having it. You feel me? You dig. You know? About this? Okay, I can't do these chopsticks. This is just no. That is far too much work to get some food. A fork would have been so much faster. How they stay skinny? So we came over here to Pho Viet, which also happens to be the Vietnamese beef noodle and grill out here in Newington, Connecticut. All right, so rock with your boy. I, th I say they serve up a mean pho over here. My first time really getting down with pho. You know, I, I didn't really understand the whole experience. I have the full experience in my hand. Wifey put me on the game. She loves this stuff. Whatever you guys want to see next, whether it's going to be the sushi spot or Indian food, hit me up in the comment section below. Let me know what you guys want to see next. Remember, this is also your channel. And, of course, don't forget, next week, next Monday, I made the announcement already that Reggie Reg is back in the building. I no longer hold down the fast food crown. You know what I'm saying? That's my main man, Ken, KBD Productions TV, and direct on Team Dame. Of course, Reggie Reg is back. And I'm going to lace a video on Monday on my channel, but be sure to subscribe to his channel because going forward, all those videos will be on his channel for fast food reviews. Here, you're getting mom and pop shops. We got to show the underdog some love, restaurant reviews, and I'm going to be doing some home cooked meals as well it's about to get crazy all right y'all other than that thanks for rocking out with your boy thanks for tuning in to this new format it means the world to me that you guys are still here you do not have to be here every last one of you could have unsubscribed already you did not you're rocking out and that's real foodie fam that's why i rock with you along with you dig because you know how we get down Every Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday. Tuesday, Wednesday, Friday, Saturday. <laughs> more and more and more. So, so office. So.
these kids take a baby. I know you can't. Hey, listen, man.